Hello, my friends. Ellen here. Hope you're having a wonderful day. And welcome to all my new and returning subscribers to episode 156 on Ellen's Homemade Delights. Before we begin, I want to share my new glasses with all of you. I had them for a couple of days. Don't they look pretty? I love them. Well, anyway, today's recipe, I'm going to show you how to make some oatmeal raisin cookies. These are the bomb.com. They're going to be so soft and chewy and it's going to have lots and lots of oatmeal and raisins. And these cookies are going to be magnificent. And your kids will love these too. All right, you ready? Let's go bake some oatmeal raisin cookie magic in my southern kitchen. All right, in my mixer, I have one stick, which is a half a cup of unsalted butter softened and four ounce packages of cream cheese. And we're gonna add in a fourth of a cup of white sugar and a half a cup of packed light brown sugar. And we're gonna cream all these ingredients together until it's nice and fluffy. All right, my friends, to our cream cheese, butter, and sugars, we're gonna add in one jumbo egg at room temperature, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, and a half a teaspoon of almond extract. And we're gonna blend all this together until it's nice and well combined. All right, my friends, over here in my bowl, I've sifted one cup of self-rising flour, half a teaspoon of baking soda, half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon, and an eighth of a teaspoon of ground allspice. And we're gonna slowly dump our flour into the butter mixture. All right, my friends, I got all my flour mixed in. So next for our last ingredient, the star of the show, we're gonna add in one and a half cups of old fashioned oatmeal, not the quick cooking or the instant, and one cup of raisins. And we're gonna slowly add them into the butter and flour mixture. And we're going to mix everything in until it's nice and well combined. All right, my friends, our cookie dough's ready. See all the raisins and the oatmeal is nice and thick. That looks perfect. Oh, I can smell the almond extract too and the vanilla. All right, so all we do now is cover our dough and we're going to put it in the refrigerator and let it chill for 30 minutes. We'll be back. my friends it's been 30 minutes and I have removed my cookie dough out of the refrigerator so now we're going to scoop our dough into a foil cookie sheet all right my friends I have taken my cookies out of the oven and look how nice and golden brown it looks and it smells awesome in this kitchen what's better than the smell of fresh baked cookies mmm all right, so all we do now is let our cookies cool for a few minutes and then we'll be ready to give it a taste. We'll be back. All right, my friends, I fixed me up a plate and you can't have cookies with a nice cold glass of milk. All right, here we go. I'm gonna show y'all the inside. Ooh, look how nice and soft they look. OMG. All right, here we go. Chewy. Bursting with flavor. Now these are some incredible oatmeal raisin cookies. Oatmeal raisin licious. Well, I want to thank you so much for watching and joining me in the kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. And I'll see y'all on my next video. Let's eat.